We are in a mass extinction right now. It is the, the sixth mass extinction in the history of our planet. And it is happening orders of magnitude faster than any previous mass extinction because it's driven by human activities, driven by us causing problems that are, are driving uh, countless species out of existence. My name is Hal Holmes. I work on new technologies and new devices that can preserve nature and prevent extinction. From an early age, I really developed a passion for, for building things. My family was a, a family of do-it-yourselfers. The house I grew up in, in rural Michigan, it was literally built by my, my father and my grandfather. And I think that's what really inspired me to become an engineer. I really got the bug to keep building more things and, and just creating uh, whatever your, your mind can come up with. One of the biggest drivers for extinction is illegal timber and wildlife trafficking. It's actually the fourth largest illicit economy as it's right behind guns, drugs, and humans. Currently, the, the process for really screening for illegal logging is, is entirely visual, and that visual inspection is, is not good enough. DNA is, is an incredibly powerful tool because no matter how that tree is, is cut, no matter how the, the product is shaped or processed, it doesn't change the DNA. My aim is to create a handheld device that can be deployed in the field to rapidly break down a sample of timber, release DNA, and enable a rapid DNA test will be in the hands of, of non-technical users that don't need any training to, to run a DNA test and to stop an illegal shipment. Histo is tissue and then tripsy is, is breakdown, so it means tissue breakdown. Hal actually reached out to me um, based on our background working together and we've always wanted to look for projects that align. I think the first question he asked me was, can histotripsy be used for trees? He thought I was crazy at first and we, we had a back and forth of where that, that question came from because it definitely came out of left field uh, for him. And then kind of elaborated into, can we develop focus ultrasound techniques that are maybe based on the fundamental histotripsy but are, are modulated such that we can develop tools for rapid DNA extraction. This is a type of, of focused ultrasound that was developed actually as a, a therapeutic for cancer where it is able to use these uh, focused sound waves that uh, coalesce and create a, a bubble cloud. And when this bubble cloud collapses, it breaks apart tumor tissue. I'm gearing this towards a way of breaking down tissue to rapidly extract DNA. DNA extraction is a very critical barrier to a lot of DNA tests, especially for moving tests in the field. I really can't even fathom what the planet would be if we lost everything, if we lost green space, if we lost all of these species. Honestly, I think the planet would be fine. The planet would recover and new species would come in to, to fill the balance, but it could be very likely that we just wouldn't be around to enjoy it anymore. This is a way that we can, not just fighting the problem, but actually having the problem cease to exist.